Good morning! I'm back. Hello, guys. Wait. Ilis ako. And I am back. So today, we're going to talk about Chinese garter. And now, let's talk about the history of Chinese garter. Chinese garter is called Chinese jump rope in other countries. It originated from China in the 7th century. They play it before during the celebration of Chinese New Year. It was passed from generation to generation and has become popular even in other countries. The game is typically played in a group of at least 3 players with a rope approximately 16 feet or 5 meters in length tied into a circle. In the definition of Chinese Chinese Garter, a game requiring flexibility, adjust, and coordination is a famous game for Filipino kids, most particularly among young ladies amid their elementary years. The game rotates around the normal garter around a few yards in length, which we brought from sewing store at around 20 pesos or less. And lastly, the mechanics. They will do rock, scissor, paper to determine who will play first. The loser of rock, scissor, paper shall serve as game posts as they stand opposite each other and hold each end of the garter. The objective of the game then is to be able to successfully jump over the garter as it is gradually held higher by the game post. Each team has its own team leader, more commonly known as the mother. Once a team member either touches the garter or fails to jump at a certain level, the mother can still save her team by taking her team member's turn. Failure to do so will lead to the team's elimination by making the new game post and will bring the game back to the first level. And lastly, Chinese garter has also benefits. Chinese garter improves and maintains cardiovascular health. It improves flexibility, balance, and coordination, and it also strengthens the muscle, promotes their development, and increases their efficiency. It boosts our immune system and it reduces obesity and diminishes the risk of having a chronic disease. And lastly, it reduces the chance of having osteoporosis. And that's it. That will be all guys for the Chinese garter. See you all soon. This is Franklin Charles M. Basilio from Pipe 2A. Bye bye.